As we saw in the US Open recently, Bryson DeChambeau on the 18th hole at Pinehurst of the US Open hit a fantastic 55-yard bunker shot to within three feet of the hole to win the US Open. In today's video, I'm gonna walk you through how to hit that same bunker shot with ease. My name is Mitchell, this is Mitchell Bynett Golf, and let's get into it. Shampo and he's popped up. All right, guys. So Bryson DeChambeau is an absolute phenomenon, and the bunker shot he hit on that 18th green was incredible. But it can be made simple if you have the right technique and also the right club selection. Now, a lot of people in the bunker they always go for their trusty 58 degree, 60 degree, even 62, their most lofted club in the bag. If we're hitting greenside bunker shots to close flags, then that works perfectly fine. But if we're hitting long bunker shots like Bryson had, we need to change club to get that extra distance. So for this one, 58 is gonna go in the, uh, in the bag and 54 is gonna be the club of choice. So we'll pop that over there. Now, in terms of technique and setup, what's very important to remember and understand here when hitting long bunker shots is a nice, wide, stable base. We are creating quite a lot of speed in this shot so we need to stay nice and stable by having a wide stance. That's number one. Number two, I want you to make sure that you have your ball position slightly further forward than the center. Now the reason for this is because we are hitting the sand behind the ball, not the ball first. So that ball position by having it further forward will help us to do that. Now, Number three as well, I want you to make sure the club face is always open. We need to get that club gliding through that sand rather than digging. So club face being open will encourage us to do that. So this is a 54, but if I open it up, it's gonna be looking more like a 58, even a 60. Now, last but not least, in terms of setup, I want you to make sure you have your weight further forward too, okay? If I have my weight too much in my trail foot, so right leg in my case, what happens is I'm gonna end up leaning back and taking too much sand before the ball and I won't get that distance that I need to get that ball on that green. So by having the weight forward, again, it's gonna help us get a nice contact and move that energy and momentum forwards towards the target, all right? Now, because I've got 54 in my hand, the ball will naturally go further. 58, yes, it's good for in the bunker, but it's only really gonna be used when you're close, around the green, hitting to short flags. With 54, we can naturally get more distance because of the more loft on the club. So there's no need to try and hit it harder with the 58. You can simply go down to a 54 and make the exact same swing and you'll get the distance you need. Let's give it a try. So I'm short-sided here, got about 40 meters to the pin, which is about 50, about 45 yards. Wide stance, okay, leaning myself into that left leg. Club face nice and open. I'm gonna make a nice, long, aggressive swing and we'll try and get it inside Bryson's. All right guys, so that's how we hit the 55 yard bunker shot like Bryson in the US Open. If you enjoyed this video, smash the like button below, subscribe to the channel and I'll see you in the next one.